Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Choose Midpen Softball Player of the Week for May 1 to 6 games. The Midpen Softball season is winding down, and some of the Region S top players are putting in tremendous performances as they push toward the playoffs. Vote here on who you think performed best this past week. In the Penlive Fan Vote for Softball Player of the Week. Voting runs Sunday noon through Tuesday noon. Vote early and often. Annika Barber, Redland. Barber had a home run and three RBIs in a 10-8 win over Northeastern on Wednesday. Dot Macy Barnhart, Carlisle Barnhart had a big moment in a 9-5 loss to Mechanicsburg Friday starting a grand slam against the undefeated Wildcats Sierra Bender. Shippensburg Bender hit 14 over 5 innings in an 11-0 on Monday win over James Buchanan. Ryan E. Dillard, Harrisburg Dillard hit a homer, and had 4 RBIs in an 8 loss to Middletown on Wednesday. Megan Fisher, Central Dothan the Rams junior catcher, won a big game for CD, and started Thursday. A walk-off homer against top rivals Cumberland Valley. Jana Freeland. Milton Hershey Freeland was 2-4-3 with 3 RBIs and an 8-6 win over Reading on Thursday. Aubrey Fren. Big Spring Fren. Went 3-4-6 with 2 homers and 8 RBIs. In a 24-3 win over James Buchanan 3-3 on Wednesday. Zoe Holbert. East Pensboro Holbert went 3-4-6 with a double 2 RBIs. And 2 runs scored to put the Panthers in power in an extra-inning loss to Fleetwood on Thursday. Riley Kunkel, Camp Hill Kunkel had a huge Wednesday afternoon against Milton Hershey, throwing four hits, five RBIs and a full game, while he was 10. Jada Lacey, Mechanicsburg Lacey had three RBIs, and threw three and two-thirds innings to get the victory in a 9-5 win for Carlisle on Friday. Morgan Lehman, Chambersburg Lehman notched both her first career hit and her first career homer as a pinch hitter on Saturday, helping the Trojans to a 5-0 win over Central York. Jesse Lee, Northern Lee was 3-4-4 with a home run and three RBIs in a 6-1 win over Big Spring on Monday. Carolyn Logsdon, 